Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Cars and Cloud. So in this video, I'm going to go through configuration of SCCM client throttling, band, throttling the bandwidth. So now let's get started. The reason we want to do this is that just say if you have a remote site that have really low bandwidth or lower network um, connections, you might want to throttle your clients in that remote site. So by doing that, you might want to create a collection for those devices that are in the remote site. So for example, I create a collection called remote site with no DP. So those clients will able to pull the contents from the primary DP. So you want to configure a bandwidth or throttling that way it will not take down your um, network connection. So here I'm in the administrations. Under administrations, um, you go to client settings. Let's see, it would be under client settings, right click. I'm going to create custom client device settings. I'm going to call this network throttling. So the one options that you're going to choose is background Intel legend transfer. Click on that and click OK. As you can see, now it has created. So I want to go back in, go to properties. Click on background intelligence. So you want to make sure you set limit maximum number bandwidth for background intelligence or BITS background transfers to yes. You what time you want to start throttlings? Usually during the business hour, so I would say eight o'clock. And throttling windows end usually after business hours. I would say five o'clock. And during this time, maximum transfer rate during throttling windows. What maximum transfer rate you want to set? If your if your network connection in the remote side is fifty six k, you want to make sure you set this to very low, lower than fifty six k. Um, just say for example. I'm going to set it, just say, for example, if it's 56K, I would set it to 30K. Allow bit download outside of throttling windows. I would say yes. And the maximum bit is, this is the maximum. You can configure it to, um, to, lower than 9,900. Oops. Just say, for example, I'm going to set it to 4. And then click OK. Once you create it or configure the throttlings, you have to deploy it to the collections. So we just right click and go to deploy and choose the um, collection you want to apply the settings to. Click on it and click OK. That's it. That's all there is to it. That's how you configure throttling for Windows uh, for Configuration Manager clients. Thank you for watching. And if you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and have a wonderful day.